everyone have a nice day today so today i would like to present my, uh, my review paper which is the title is a review on experimental ex ex investigation and geotechnical characteristic of pit soil stabilization so i'm is the author for this paper which is my name is nur akila bin Tisayda, and my co-author is elista dylan george and i am dr hadi as you can show, uh, this is my abstract for this paper, which is the you know, pit soil is organic soil, which is consists more than 70% of organic matter and can be recognized from the color and texture, rest in geotechnical engineering, all soil with organic content greater than 20% are considered with organic soil. More than that, pit soil mostly from Malaysia is tropical pit. This pit has thin feature that distinguish it from the of the type of pit soil. This soil is normally dark reddish brown to black and made, made up of partially decomposed leaf, branches, twigs and tree trunk with a low mineral content in its natural natural state. So, various of experimental research and study has been conducted to improve the end stabilize of pit soil due to compressibility and geotechnical characteristic of pit soil. Therefore, for this our review, we will use method for injection method of eco process puzzling which is we call EPP that will be used to increase the stabilization of pit soil. More than that, we will conduct index properties like a bone post scale, natural moisture content, liquid limit, bulk unit work, specific gravity, initial weight ratio, pH value, plastic limit, fiber content, on organic content. This is the introduction. So, for the first introduction, in Malaysia, is known, pit soil approximately cover 2.76 million hectare in Peninsula, Sarawak, and Sabah. The pit soil usually found in Klangkot, Johor, Malacca, Alostar, Sabah, Sarawak, and some port is coast area. Pit soil is a pit that has a low shear strength, high moisture content, and high compressibility, which is the biggest enemy of the stabilization of the soil. More than that, pit soil also not suitable for any constructions such as highway, building, or any construction due to its physical and chemical properties. Pits is the surface organic layer of the soil that is made up of partially decomposed organic matter, mostly from plant material that has accumulated due to waterlogging, oxygen deficiency, high acidity, and nutrient deficiency. It is very important to find another solution to improve the stabilization and strength for this permitted soil due to development are very limited. So, for the past researcher, uh, the server, there are several consolidation testing techniques and growth improvement are used in this area. The, conven the conventional technique like 1D or a meter consolidation system and others. Sometimes certain studies need conducted by using advanced consolidation system and not appropriate in some situation to improve the, the stabilization of soil. Therefore, it's very important to find another solution. Another convenience, convenience method was by using your cell instead of convenience, conventional method because by using your cell can overcome most of the most of the disadvantages of the conventional organic apparatus like the common consolidation test. This is the map for the type of soil at Sabah which is like uh, like a pit soil reddish brown and others so uh, at that column we shown that it is the pit soil in area for buffered area so I will show you the presentation list content so for this presentation we will start with abstract objective pit soil what is pit soil what is index properties of pit soil and how reservation of pit soil so and then we will discuss and show the result of the pit soil and lastly we will show you the conclusion so I that they have three objectives for this project so i will show you this is the objective if is to study the index properties of pit soil in clear buffet sabah 
The second adjective is to evaluate the compressibility characteristic of put cell by using raw cell. And the lastly is to assess the stabilization relationship between pit soil and eco process porcelain, which is EPP. So for next slide, I will show you the type of pit soil at clear spot. So you can see some picture of pit soil at clear spot. So what is pit soil? Pit soil is organic material it is formed by biochemical process where the areas the process of organic material accumulation is mainly a direct function of environmental condition, the climate and the ecosystem such as a pit, swamp, box or mires in which the pit is formed. Besides that, pit can be defined, which is general and consolidated organic material consisting largely of organic residues of incomplete decomposition of dead plant constituents under condition of excessive moisture by Ali Hausadia et al. 2020. It also formed primarily from decaying organic substrate and the biomass of decomposer communities consuming them. Vegetation facilities pit accumulation by adding organic subterranean litter both, on, both onto the pit surface and into the pit in rooting zone. In addition, pit has been described as histosol and soil that contain at least 65% of organic or conversely less than 35% mineral content. The color of pit usually is dark brown or black and with distensive order. I show you the class of pit in our standard, which is ASTM standard. So from this from this table, I can show you the classification of pit based on ASTM, ASTM standard. We have three standard, which is for fiber content, ash content, and acidity content we have three type of fiber content which is fabric hemic and separate for fabric pit with greater than 67 fibers so for hemic pit with between 30 33 percent and 17 percent while the so for separate we have pit with less than 30 percent of fiber so for next we has we have ash content there are three type of ash content which is low medium and high so for the low is pit with less than five percent of ash while medium have between five and fifteen percent and lastly for high we have more than fifteen percent of ash so for the next is we have acidity so we have three type we also have four type of acidic which is high acidic moderate acidic and slightly acidic and basic so for the next slide i will explain to you about the index properties of pit soil properties there are several unique physical properties of pit which it should be considered when discussing it as stated that the physical such characteristics such as color degree of humification water content organic content should be included in a full description of pit generally pit physical properties of pit soil which was collected from pit layer was determined by performing moisture content fiber content organic content ash content bulk density lineage linear shrinkage liquid limit ph specific gravity gra and specific gravity so in the geotechnical term pit soil known as a problem problematic soil due to its physical properties due to pit soil has very high moisture content high fiber content low permeability and low shear strength the properties is about the degree of humification moisture content organic content fiber content and specific gravity so from this slide uh, you will see the definition and the significance of for the index properties so for next slide i will tell you about how we distribute of pit soil how so for this slide i will tell you about the, the distribution of pit soil and the stabilization method that we can be used for pit soil first point for distribution of pit soil is the total pitland area in southern asia is approximately 24.7 million hectare of which 
20.7 million hectare of Indonesia. And secondly, peat soil is typically referred to as one of the most troublesome due to its pressure strength, high water content, and low specific gravity. It can also be compressed to a great extent. More than that, peat soil is a highly permeable material, material in its natural state, and the magnitude of the, the initial primary consolidation settlement under lot is normally large and the period of settlement is short, usually by the stabilization method that we can use. So, in this slide, I will explain about what type we can be used to stabilize the pit soil. So, firstly, stabilized pit soil outperform non-stabilized soil when substance design and construction are nicely considered. When the stabilized soil layer is incorporated into the structural, structural layout of the pavement, the subsequent layer may be thinner, enjoying in big value saving. So, uh, for the next is about the exit to off-site soil stabilization procedure are feasible, however, are normally reserved for the environmental task greater than usually construction operation. So, we can conclude there are many methods of stabilizing the soil, including using stabling, using cement, bitumen, electrical stabilization, stabling using grouting, and using geotextile and fabric. For while for the traditional chemical additive like lime, cement can be also be used for the treatment. So for this research, I will confirm the efficiency of the eco process porcelain, which is a EPP, can be used as a stabilizing agent for the pavement subbase layer and the foundation system, which is relative movement and excessive settlement concern. So I will for the next slide I will explain about you what is EPP, what is material in EPP that can be used as a binder for our stabilization method. To mention the method that we can use for this review is injection method, which is injection method is the process of filling join in a pore space in soil with a crowd without disturbing the formation. Because the advantages of this method has a long term increasing in strength, especially for some binder use. So this technique and method has been be used to reduce the ground permeability and control ground water flow, but it also can be used to strengthen and stiffen the ground. About eco process porcelain. Of course, everyone not too much know about EPP. So I will explain about I will explain to you about the definition of EPP and what is EPP. So acroprovinces porcelain EPP, which is the product of extraction of spent bleaching earth, which is we call SBE from palm oil refineries, has also been used as a cement replacement material. This material was material possess porcelainic properties which mainly causes consists of high amount of silica, which is we extract from the waste product of crude palm oil degumming and bleaching process from refining plus plant which is the waste can be affect our environment which is pollution bleaching bleaching earth is a very fine powder clay and its main component is silicon dioxide used for refining process of palm oil and it byproduct is known as pan bleaching earth sbe is commonly disposed to landfill at high cost Therefore, a core process porcelain method is a method which may exclude a settlement problem of pit soil, which is can reduce our waste problem. So, for this review, we will review about to study the compressibility of pit soil stabilized with various quantity of EPP, which they were subjected to raw cell consolidation. So we have come to the peak of the review, which is to the result and discussion. So I will show you about the result and discussion. For the result and discussion, we will discuss about the compressibility and the moisture content of pit soil. So the compressibility is the high water content in the pit soil. The value of the concentration is high in this study. It's 
natural state pit is a made my, mainly of water in decaying plant pieces and it has very little measurable strength which is the compressibility of peat soil will increase due to the peat soil has higher because the peat soil has higher moisture content about moisture water content which is the peat soil in this study had an extraordinary high moisture content high organic content and very low dry density indicating that it is a very problematic soil that should not be used as structure soil foundation because it is commonly referred to as problematic soil because of its poor strength high compressibility high water can high water content and high organic content here first about compressibility from previous research So for this research, uh, for this past previous research, I have been take from Kazimian and Huat in 2019. So the compressibility properties of pit soil are shown in a figure. The properties of pit soil are shown in figure one because of the high water content in the pit soil, the value of the consolidation is high in this study. As a result, the ratio compressibility is quite high. Figure two and figure one show that the type of sample where the pit soil were mixed with different percentage of cement, where figure one and two shown the result of compressibility of pit after putting various quantity of cement. The results shown that when the percentage of cement increased, the compressibility of pit soil was decreased. Moreover, when it comes to determining the compressibility parameters, the steep slow showed that the pit had high compressibility and compression index. This proven that the usage of cement in pit soil as a binder can be used since the laboratory testing proved that by mix pit with a cement can reduce the compressibility of pit soil due to pit soil has a higher moisture content. Discussion about moisture water content. Moisture water content, I get two types of previous research which similar with my, re my own review which is car from Cartesian and Ramachandran 2007 and Buba Tiraja et al. from 2014. So, from this figure, two type of figure, the result of the physical attribute test conducted for this investigation are shown in figure one and figure two. The result of properties test has been compared to those others research researcher, revealing that this study finding are in good accord with theirs. The pit soil in this study had extraordinary high moisture content, high organic content, and a very low dry density, indicating that it's a very problematic soil that should not be used as a structured soil foundation. So based in figure one, it's shown that by adding fly ash as a binder, the moisture content of pit was low while the dry density increased in its natural state pit is made mainly of water indicating plant pieces and it's a very little measurable strength because of its low strength and high moisture content pit is usually referred to as problematic soil pit is commonly referred to as problem because of its because of its moisture strength and high compressibility high water content and high organic content I will show you about the finding past research. There are four types of past research, like from the Darzi Huat, Durai Sami Huat 2007, Jorat et al. 2013, Kolai et al. 2011, and Metaluxen et al. 2010. So all this research shown that they're doing their research by adding some other element to, to know and improve and increase the strength of pit soil. Like they will, for other research, they use cement, fly ash, lime, and others. Here our conclusion that I will show you.
the, the behavior of peat soil can be proven by using EPP as stabilizer. So, because the peat soil behavior before and after stabilizing also can be observed. Next, the index properties for the peat soil will be analyzed according to the BS 1337-1990. So, the difference between the results obtained by early researchers are attribu attributed attributable to a variety of factors such as site condition so we can conclude that the pit soil can combine with EPP and cement as a binder will get greatly improved settling behavior of pit soil. Uh, that's all from me thank you have a nice day everyone for any question or not understand you can ask me from you can ask and type at our comment. Thank you.